Hello, gentlemen, and welcome to yet another episode of the Gentleman's Club. I'm your host, DJ Mark Antimate. I'm bringing a new segment to the Gentleman's Club channel in which I am entitling Gentleman's Tech. Now, I'm a guy that absolutely loves headphones, and for about the past three years, I've been using the Street by 50 on ear headphones. Finally, I have found something that is better than that. The bad news is that the price is about twice as expensive, if not three times more, depending on where you buy it. So, in this episode, I'm going to be reviewing the Sony MDR 1A headphones. Now the MSRP on this is about $299, which is $300, but you could probably pick them up for about $20 less, if not a little bit significantly less on Amazon or eBay or other websites that are not retail. Now the reason that I decided to upgrade to these is just that the sound quality is just that much more balanced and a little bit better than the Street by 50s, not by a lot but enough to make me want to upgrade and I like the styling of these as well. So these are really lightweight headphones and as you can see it's tailor made for a gentleman not just with the look but with the sound as well this is all around goodness. So this has a very professional look with this very soft leather headband and the plush memory foam leather ear cups now these are very comfortable whereas those 50 cent headphones that I had were on ear these are over ear and like I said these have a well balanced sound suited for a gentleman as well whereas something like a Beats by Dre is going to look loud and it's going to sound loud and the bass is going to be overpowering these are about the most balanced headphones that I've heard in a while now there is an even more expensive model of these out which are wireless but these are the wired edition that came before. The headphone drivers are 40 millimeter, and Sony is calling these high res audio headphones. Now what that label means is that these have an ultra wide frequency meaning that it can pick up sounds from 3 hertz to about 100 kilohertz. Now that's better audio than a recorded CD. High resolution audio usually means 96 kilohertz with 24 bits or even 192 kilohertz with 24 bit which is much higher than CD. These headphones could pick up as high as 100 kilohertz which is quite nice if you have some super audio CDs that you listen to or you downloaded some high resolution tracks off the internet. Let's go back again to the luxurious look of these headphones. Now there is two different colors of these. You can either get it in black and like a metallic gray silverish color or you can get the ones that I have which are brown leather and silver. Just brown leather looks a lot more professional in my opinion. Now to let you know what you get inside the box and everything that comes with these, this comes with two microphone cables, just a regular cable and then a second cable with a one button inline remote and microphone so that you could take phone calls. Now this is made for Android phones specifically. You might get some functionality with iPhones but it's going to be quite limited. Again Android is going to suit this a whole lot better. The other thing included with this is a carrying pouch but I reckon you can get a better carrying pouch if you order a third party hard carrying case off of Amazon that could fit these. Now these also have swiveling ear cups for easy portability and they'll lay flat against your neck chest area quite well. If you have a little bit more money inside of your budget definitely go for the wireless ones but if you don't need wireless or you're trying to save a little bit of cash go ahead and pick these up. Just because these are a bit older than the wireless model the price should be going down just a tad. Now again, I listen to a lot of headphones and I'm a DJ, so I'm really an audio file freak and I want the best that money can buy. Out of about 100 headphones that I tested, I still have my top three that I go to 
which are the Street by 50 on ear, these, and V Moda. But these are currently at the top of my list. If I could rate them on a scale from 1 to 5 stars, with 5 being the best, they hit the mark completely and get a full 5. Alright, guys, I'd like to thank you for watching and make sure you stay tuned right here for another Gentleman's Tech episode on the Gentleman's Club channel. As always, take care and keep it classy.